Hey, how's it going? For today, gonna be doing some taming. We finally got the Dinosuchus added into the base game of Ark. Now that used to be a modded creature from ASE, and it's one of the ones from Garuga that they're actually putting into the base game, man. Fantastic creature. Terrifying, but fantastic. Not sure if they changed anything with it. It's like a Sarko, but a lot bigger, and has some different abilities. Now, unless they changed it, the taming on that guy used to be passive, so it's it's gonna be interesting, man. It's gonna be interesting. So we need to make some kibble. I've already got some gilly made, and then we can head right out. Now, we should have quite a few eggs in here. Let's check that first. Oh, we got a bunch, man. Oh, uh, we got a ton of them. So the spoil time in here is two hours. In our inventory, it's half an hour. And what about the refrigerator? Two days as well. So it's not too bad. So this is a modded fridge. We got 8,000 slots. So what we might do, seems how these don't stack, is we'll make a folder in here and probably move some over. Now we do need kibble for the taming. All we have is the best. That's all that we ever make. We got three pieces here. We got four of those. Let's make... Let's make four more on the kibble. And that should be enough, I think, for today. What I want to do is try to get a male and a female, if possible, and do some breeding. Not sure how much of the kibble we'll need, but seeing how we got the better breeding mod, we'll try to find the high level one first, and then just a super low level one for the second one. That way we might have enough of the stuff. There's four of those. I do got a primitive set of gilly made. Now... Being a, a passive tame, it's it's very sketchy, man. You gotta wait till it's out, like, kind of basking in the sun. It'll have his mouth open. We gotta sneaky sneaky get up to it. Put a piece of kibble on his tongue. Back up. Let it eat it. It'll probably walk around some. Wait for it to calm back down and do that again. So, that means we have to clean out everything that's in the swamp before we do the taming. <laughs> it's gonna be... It's gonna be fantastic, like, horrible, man. That's the way that it goes. I'm hoping we got enough stuff for the kibble. We might be out of berries. Might have to grab some with the beaver. So there's two. We'll do the other two in a minute. We don't have enough slots in here. Let's see about the new saddle. So fiber, metal, and hide. Not too bad. Not sure what they drop from. What color drop. We'll try to grab some drops along the way. Let's unlock that. And that's made in the smithy. One of you, please. Now we get back here, we need to make a nanny, and then we should be able to do our breeding and everything. I think we have everything for that, right? Let's just make it now. We can. Cool. Now I'm thinking for her, we'll probably just set her inside here for the moment. We probably will do all of our breeding and stuff right outside there, but the range on this guy is, it's massive, man. Very, very nice. So we'll leave her here for now, and we'll deal with the food and stuff later. Oh, we got a level. That doesn't happen very often. I guess let's do stamina. We're trying to get that up to 200 so we can run when stuff is trying to eat us. And then what is our... Or 130. We've got to get five more levels before we can start making the tech forge and things like that over on the center. Let's do our other two pieces of kibble. Nice, nice. We could make some more chowder. To take more... I think seven should be enough. With our taming rates, let's check on this. Do we have any paints? We have to paint it, man. It's required, dude. Six fields, we got four. Let's go ahead and make up one of those. One more kibble. Let's grab... Well, that's enough water. Let's do one of the black dyes. And that'll be good for now. That'll kind of get this sorted out. We've got our ghillie. Let's put that on. We are taking this with us, too. I wonder if we should, we should wear our... Hmm. Maybe we should wear this first. That way, if we get attacked by something along the way, which we're going to, man. We're going to the swamp. It'll save this for whenever we actually get there and start taming. Now, we could take some bug spray, too. I don't think it's required for the taming. However, if we lose our armor set for some reason, good possibility. We can probably use a bug spray and have the same effect. I think, man, I think. Did that give me the option to paint the kibble? That's kind of weird. Wasted a paint, but... <laughs> is what it is. Alright, let's turn this off. And then I think... Let's grab the bug spray. I think we're ready to go. We got two jars of it. Two buckets. That should be fine. We got food. We got water. Let's put this in here. We're not too overweight, right? 
116. It's all the uh, saddle and stuff. That should be good, man. Alright, let's close this. How many of the soul traps do we have? <laughs> let's make a few more before we leave. I keep forgetting to. Let's just do 10. And that'll get us sorted out. Is your inventory empty? It is. Fantastic. Nice, man. Nice. Pretty excited about it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you empty? Let's pick you up. I was out doing a little bit of farming and stuff and got our metal sorted out. I mean, sorted out for now. So, this is a regular version of the Anki. I thought it was an S version, but we have the normal ones. We gotta talk, man. <laughs> I know, I know the past couple videos have been getting stuff together for the Maywing. If you notice, it's not here. So, off camera, I've been doing quite a bit of farming, trying to get stuff ready, getting more metal, doing a little bit of exploring, stuff like that. And it turns out the Maywing, the S versions, are what was causing the crashing. It wasn't the base game or anything else. Riding them, I was getting a lot of stutter and stuff, and then I crashed, I don't know, four or five times off camera. Let's get our stamina, we'll just swim across. And it turns out it was a mod. Somebody left me a comment and said that they had problems too with the S version dinos and like the shiny mod or another tame mod mixed in. So it kind of came down to do I want to keep the shiny mod or do I want to keep the S dinos? Now, S dinos are only going to be used for this map. So obviously I went ahead and got rid of those. That means that the Maywing is gone. I think part of the issue is was not the S dinos themselves, but the Maywing because it's not in the base game yet, right? It's kind of like a modded creature. So maybe we'll try it again. I see the shark back there. <laughs> Maybe we'll try it again once Maywings are actually in the game. I can't remember what map those came from. I think it's Gen 2. So it's a super long ways away. But I went ahead and did some dino wipes, so everything's kind of cleaned off the map. Everything is fresh and new. I'm hoping that we'll be able to find some of the new dinos, the dinosuches. Now, they're kind of like Sarkos, right? So I'm guessing they'll spawn in the same place. One thing I'm worried about is this being a mod map. I'm not sure if he needs to add those in manually or... If since they're kind of a base creature, if they're going to show up naturally in the general location, you know? So we'll see, we'll see. We'll get up here to the swamp. It's the best place to look. We'll try to find some. If we do, great. If not, we might jump over to the center, because I know they're going to be on that map. It's one of the, the vanilla ones, right? Rude. Highly rude. I am just saying. So I'm not sure what flavor the drops are going to be for the saddles. I checked the purple one back there. Just got some of the shotgun ammo. I'm not sure if the gators are up here. I can't remember where I find the Sarkos at, man. Other than the swamp, you know? Now there's a place that's kind of behind the swamp. I'm not sure what's in that, that land area. Because it wasn't really developed whenever I was playing it on ASC. A lot's changed, man. A ton has changed between then and now. And I'm not sure what's done in the game and what's not. Because I was playing in the early beta on ASC version, you know? But I'm hoping to be able to use those on the boss fight here soon. So all we really got left is... Getting some of the, the creatures, which we're doing today, hopefully. And then we need to start getting some of... Is that Sarah's or Allosaurus? We need to start getting some of the artifacts done. We got a ton of artifact caves. Not sure how many are on this map, but it's supposed to be all the ones that were over on the island, from what I heard. So it should be quite a few. Right up here is a swamp. I need to change the settings on the cat. I think he's on passive. What is your setting? Neutral. Let's put you on passive. Main reason being, we're gonna get knocked off of our team by Cat Pro. It's gonna happen, dude. Always happens. I expect it to today as well. Help you out, buddy. Let me help you out. Yep, you got Raptors, you got Allosaurs. And I want him to be by me if that happens and I get dismounted. And me be able to whistle for him to attack, you know? And not just run off. Oh, there's a gator there. Holy crap, dude. Nice, dude. Nice. So that's a level 50 junior, man. Junior, look, dude, look. You are not the center of attention. So they are on this map. It's a good thing to know. I think we're going to wait. I want to go into the swamp. And main thing we're looking for is a high level one. If we can find a high level one, then we know what gender we need for the other one. Because don't forget, we are kind of limited on... Yeah, right? <laughs> the Trudon's playing with them, dude. Big mouth though, man. They are massive, dude. I wonder if they have the gigabyte. <gasps> he turned shiny. Oh, dude. Why is that a thing? Right before our eyes, man. Change from a normal flavor to a shiny one. Look, it's pink. I don't care. It's a level 180. We well, gotta tame him. So 
We're probably gonna die here. I don't know if it's good that he's out of the swamp or not. So we need for him to calm down. Let's get rid of this guy. Let's get rid of the Dillo, the Raptor. All this stuff needs to go away. That way we don't have any aggro from... from the Gator, you know? So once he calms down, he should kind of pick a spot where he's out in the sun. He'll open his mouth very, very wide. And that's where we need to sneak up there and then throw a piece of kibble in. Kind of like that! Let's do this. Wait. He's biting something. Don't go into the swamp. Don't go into the swamp, Junior! That's got a level. Let's put it into damage. We need him to be over here. He's 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 chasing something though. Something small he can't bite, maybe a Trudon. Might be able to help him out. Bees, man. Bees. Ants. I need to jump off the cat and pick him up. Terrifying thing. Be this close to the swamp. I want to keep these and those. And that's not you! So we got <laughs> we got regular Sarkos and Capros to worry about as well. Okay. Is that a Sarah? Why are there Sarahs in the swamp? Dude, it is not safe, man. Is he relaxing? Let's do this. That down here. Put these in here. That's and that's. Drop you. Keep all this stuff in our inventory and out of there. We need for him to... to stop moving. Whenever he does, we'll pick up the cat. Oh, it's, there he is. Heard the Dimorphodon. Didn't know where he was at, though. Calm down, buddy. There we go! There we go! Buddy, stay there. Stay there. Alright, so get up close. Sneaky, sneaky. There's some ants on the ground. It's terrifying. No! Nope, not right now. He said, nope. <laughs> Look, Junior, I get it, man, I get it. He's not always wanting food. That's the thing. And if you keep going and get too close, he will attack you and it'll kind of reset the process. I should have <laughs> I should have looked back on my video from the last one that I tamed back in ASC so that I know the exact process, you know? I don't know if they're adding in the elephants. I can't remember the name of them. But those things are no joke, dude. Hopefully they don't. Those things are so super annoying, man. You gotta feed them beer. Kinda cool. I can't remember if we're supposed to approach these from the side? Or directly in front. No! Run away! There's something to the mechanic. I can't remember if it's straight ahead or not. Maybe you gotta, you gotta approach from the front, not from the side. There you go, buddy. There you go, man. The sun's coming out. It's a good spot. Relatively safe area other than the ants. I mean, for the most part at the moment. Not sure what happened to that Sarah. The colors are horrible on this guy. Not your fault, though. Not your fault. We can fix it. Let's pick up the cat up. That way it's easier to get away. There we go, man. There we go, right in the sun. Open your mouth, okay? Sneaky, sneaky. The rock's in the way. There we go! Holy crap, dude! It's so loud, dude. <laughs> it's so super loud! Now he's gonna move around. So two pieces of kibble... We'll get this guy tamed up. So we should have enough to get a second one. Now that's a female, right? It is. We gotta run around this way. Now it is a limited time, I think, that he has his mouth open. Don't go that way! That's the swamp, Junior! I don't know if he aggro's other stuff, if that changes the... effectiveness or not. But yeah, he'll get up and roam around, man. It's kinda cool, kinda terrifying. I didn't know that they will change- I thought the shiny spawned in as a shiny. I didn't know that it changes the creatures... ...that are already in the world, you know? Let's go over here.
Crouch down. One more, buddy. One more. Stay right there. You're fine. You're fine. No! Oh, we got him! Oh, dude, we almost messed that up. Holy crap, dude. We got him. We were right? Junior! <laughs> that was terrifying, man. Oh. Explore note. Nice, nice. We good? Let's pick this guy up. Now, arc be an arc. Save the game. Is that another one? Did you hear it? Let's get on the cat. That might be another one that we heard. Let, let's get over here for the moment. Take a look at the stats on this one. Ah, dude. That is awesome! It was not only a shiny, but it was a max level shiny, right? 180 is the max level on those. So it's a female. It's a hefty princess, so that means it's going to have higher on the weight. Holy crap, we got 75 points in the weight. That is massive, dude! Going to be using that thing for farming like crazy. So we got 55 points into health, 51 into stamina, weight is 75, and then 47 into damage. That's not too bad on the damage, too. Yep, I heard you guys, man. I heard you! So the absolute values are 12,001, or in point one into health. The stamina is 1830. Our weight is 1,500, man, and then 433 in the damage. Now, they can be, like, really good uh, water mounts as well. Not sure if we can shoot off of them. Let's get over here, throw it out real quick, and then we'll head into the swamp and try to get one more. I want to put the saddle on it to get it out of our inventory. We're stuck inside of it. It's kind of weird. Yeah, there we go, man. Look how big it is compared to the cat. That is massive, dude! So we've got... Normal bites. Gigabyte is gonna be the right mouse button. Hold it down, his mouth opens up. And I think he just release it. Yep. And he does that. You gotta charge it again. A little charge attack. Super slow to charge up. Oh, we gotta wait for it. There is a timer. Probably about a 30 second timer. And we can do it again. That's awesome, man. Ah, uh, that is fantastic. How much base damage do you do? <laughs> 714. 714! I don't want to fight the Rex. We gotta fight the Rex. We gotta fight the Rex. 25, it'll be fine. You can use weapons on them! Not sure how I feel about that. Kind of seems broken. We'll pick him up if we die for some reason. Let's charge the Gigabyte. Bite him right in the butt, man. Right in the butt! 1840 on damage. That is nuts, dude! I saved you guys! Might have nibbled on you. Don't seem happy. Yep, 34 a hit. <laughs> to the trikes. Kind of pushes him back a little bit, too. Let's do the Gigabyte. We'll take out the whole family at once. That is crazy, man. I'm so glad they left that in. Yep. The trikes, man, they're so tanky when you hit the... hit them from the front. Junior, look, man, we'll, we'll, we'll charge up the bite again. Yep, yep, got something for you. Here we go. That kind of works out. Alright, let's get back up here to the saber. And then we'll go ahead and... Oh, there's one there. We did hear a second one. That's a female. We need a male one. So we'll leave that one alone. Did you drop an arm? You did. We'll try to find a decent one. Now, <laughs> since we're going in here, let's put this on. And save our ghillie. Until we kind of clean an area out. I don't want to fight that guy. Holy crap, dude. I do not want to fight him with the cat. I don't think they'll rip you off your teams. I kind of don't want to find out. Is that another one? They're all over the place. That's a male 20. Are they fighting? Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's kill you off. Come here, buddy. Gator tail. That's all we need is a super low level one. We can use that for our breeding. Let's kill off the other one that's over here. The other female. I didn't want to fight it, but we'll see what kind of damage it does to the cat. We're only doing 278. Now you saw that thing with the Gigabyte did like 1800 damage, you know? That's what he's getting ready to do there. Yep, you missed. Kind of squishy. Not too bad. Now, do we get the, the Sarko skin from it? 
for the drop? Oh, we do. Interesting. Okay, well, that works. Give me that, please. And thank you. Alright, so, let's clean the area out. And then we'll start taming this one. And that should be only one piece of kibble to get this one tamed up. Oh, he's ready. Wait, wait, I'm not, though. Okay, okay, we're up here. Sneaky, sneaky. Alright, buddy, alright. Nope, nope. <laughs> Wants nothing to do with it. Thought I saw something. Give it a second. We are super, super close to the swamp. I still want to go in there and see if the dwarves are back. Since I did the Dino White. Alright. Try it again. If he bites us, it's probably going to be like a one bite. There we go. Nice, dude. Nice. Male and a female for teaming. Calm down, Junior. Back up, buddy. Back up. That is awesome, man. Ah, oh, dude. I am so glad they're back in the game. So, we have our male and female. And we are going to save the game again. Just in case, man, I think that the crash was, I guess it was due to the Maywing, but just in case, man. So, dwarves were on this side. There's another one. There's a 130! Should we try to tame that one to get some better... Damage stat? They are all over the place. There's a 140 female man! The swamp just got more dangerous. You got Capros. You've got Sarkos. You've got Dinosuches. You've got the Leeches. You've got the Ants. Everything in the world's around here. Berries as well. And in this one, <laughs> we've got the Dwarves. Speaking of that, they should be right up here. Oh, this is a snail. We need to make some... Veggie Cakes. That was super loud, dude. Should we try to tame the other male? It's a 130, dude. If it has better stats on the damage... How much kibble do we got? We got four pieces of kibble. That's at 130 right next to it, though, right? Dude, you got a 130 and a 140 right next to each other. I really like how this map has such high-level creatures. We got a 95 male over there. Ah, oh, we got a leech, too. That's rude! You're right, buddy. It's right on your snout, man. Let me get it. Let me get it. No! We're fine. I want to drag the female away. We could tame them both, man. And check them for stats, you know? But the thing is, we need to separate them. It's gonna be, it's gonna be hard to do. Junior, you need to go somewhere else, buddy. I know, you, you, you're, you're parentless. It happens, though, man. It happens. It's not safe. Oh, they're getting separate. One go that way. One go this way. Get rid of you two. 145 even on the pig. Ah, watch out! Watch out! Yep. Pig had a bad day. And they're back together. That kind of sucks. Guys, look. Stop coming this way, man! I thought we were going to have problems finding one. We have a whole family over here of the Dinosuches. Are they back to back or face to tail? They're face to tail. Let's let's try it. Nope. No! Nope. Oh, dude! Okay, Capro. Yep. That's the most terrifying gator! Holy crap, dude. Did you see him jump across? You tried, didn't you? Oh, my gosh! <laughs> dude, it is no joke over here. It is no joke, man. Ugh. Where's the Capro? He's right there. He's coming this way. I need to change my arrows out. Get behind the tree! No, he still got me! I didn't change my arrows! Um, okay, hold on. My fault, my fault. Yep, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We got the dinosaur just here! We're gonna die, dude! Junior! Oh, <gasps> no! The saber's on passive! I didn't bring a sleeping bag! That's my fault. 100% that's my fault. I got... too comfortable. By a large margin. There's a theory out there. So, here's the problem, man. We don't have... any other creatures to run back on.
We got this cat. I was going to use for for breeding. We got a raptor. We're going to lose our saber. 100% we're going to lose our saber, man. That sucks, dude. Wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? We got a blueprint in here, right? We got a saddle, right? We do. Let's do that. Now this cat has no points. Absolutely none. Which is fine. It's such a long run back, dude. Very long run. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's put some points into... That a little bit. A little bit into damage, I guess. Ah, oh, dude, this is gonna suck. Let's do this as well. 100% my fault, man. I got way too comfortable. <laughs> around those creatures. That do so much damage, man! Maybe we should do more points into this. For stamina. And then we need to do... One of these. <sighs> Electronics. I need to be able to pick up the cat as soon as we get over there. Oh, it's new time. I hate that, man. Give me the option to turn that off, please, and thank you. 3,300 meters away. It is so far. We need 15. We don't have enough pearls! Look, we can't do that, man. Let's do three more of these. It'll be fine. All we have to do is run up there, jump on our cat. Let's close the door. Let's not freak out. We need to run up there, jump on our cat, and then we can worry about getting our bag and stuff. I mean, that bag is super important, man. It has both of our teams. One being a shiny, if I lose it, I'm gonna lose it, okay? <laughs> Give me a minute. Let me get back to the other side of the map, and we'll put out the sleeping bags just in case. We're gonna be okay swimming across here. Let's wait and get our stamina. The cat is hungry as well. Where are we looking in the water? Where's that shark? He's way over there at the end. Okay, we should be fine, man. All right, so we're almost back up here. I tell you what, man. One of the most terrifying things in the world is going through the cut-through for the mountain where the spiders are with no torch. <laughs> I was just jumping and running. I did kill off a couple sabers that were up by there, though. Got some meat for the cats. Our health is down a little bit. There was that megalodon that was in the water. It's kind of munching on me as I was swimming across. I don't want to play with the raptors, dude. I'm really hoping it's not going to be too bad for grabbing our bag. I mean, I want our cat, too. But the bag is definitely something that we need, you know? So let's do this. Let's go up the hill over here. And that's where we'll set out our sleeping bags. Can the grass please load in? Please and thank you. There we go. This should be somewhat safe-ish up here. Can we not do that off of the cat? Can't. I don't plan on dying that much, but just in case. I mean, we will be over here at the swamp quite a bit, so we'll kind of just leave them there. Should have brought a foundation and a bed, to be honest with you. Alright, so, we're gonna hug the left side. And try to grab that stuff, and then... Ah, oh man, I hope our cat's okay. So I'm not sure how far down here that the dwarves are. That's one thing I'm really worried about. And if we get ripped off by a Capro, which, don't forget, we were kind of fighting one up here, I'm not sure what to do because I don't have any armor, and I don't have... Where is... that? I don't have anything to fight him with. Yep, cat's taking damage. Cat's taking damage. Ah, oh, dude. He's got a very good saddle, but that doesn't really mean too much. Did we die? Up here. Okay, the gators are still there. Neutral, buddy. Fight him. Wait, 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 wait. Follow all. Passive. <gasps> no! Him! Him! Guys, there's two Capros. There couldn't be just one, right? Him! Guys! No, please! It's not safe. It is not safe. Dude, have an eight. Was that a raptor? Having a 130 and a 140 right next to each other? <laughs> that is not... That is horrible. There was two of the Capros there, too. So there was a gator. There's a Carno, too. We're going to die again. He's running that way. There's a gator somewhere around here. 
There's a raptor there too. Okay, look, man, look. We might have to respawn it at base again. Good thing we put points into our stamina. Okay, okay, I think we're okay. Nope, there's a Dillo there. There's a Sarko. Crap. I hear you. I just don't want to see you. Okay? So we'll get up here. <gasps> okay, one saber tooth dead. Junior. Junior. Junior! No! We're all alone. Don't get aggro. Which bag is this? It's the Capros I'm super nervous about. That little bit of armor would not have helped. Let them all go that way. That's the bag that we just died with, right here. So I'm not really worried about that one. It's the other one. That has all our stuff in it. Oh, that's a saber. Wait, which one is this? That's our good one. I don't have an Oasis sword, so no use in actually having that. Or keeping that. There's the other one. No, please, no, please, no, please, no, please don't see me, you don't see me. You don't see me, you don't see me, you don't see me. Does crouching do anything in Ark? For lowering your visibility? Okay, the Capro's dead. That's what you deserve! Where is... No, I deleted the wrong one! Not that one. Not that one! No! You have got to be kidding me! I see you, leech. Stay back! I should have deleted either one of those. Wait, no! What was that one? I should have left the other one too! Wasn't it over here? We were in the corner. Look for a bag, man. Look for a bag. I don't think we were up here, right? We were over here, on the side. I don't see a bag! So the other death was over here, right? Wasn't it by this? Oh, right here. Please tell me that's it. Holy crap, dude. That was horrible. Alright, so, we need to... get out this guy. Neutral. Let's put on our good gear. I don't want to eat my kibble. Let's get out of the swamp. <laughs> Look, dude. We are going like a gnat in a hurricane. Never to return? I should not have messed with those two gators, man. Two of those guys back-to-back, -back, that high level. The uh, bite on them being so high. Should have known for sure. Now, will the... Capros come for us still? Most stuff should leave us alone. I should have aggroed this Sarko, just in case. Tell you what, let's get out of here. I'm sorry, buddy. You're a 145. It's a 145. You caused me problems, though. I am taking you out. We don't do too much damage with our normal bites, so... Let's, uh, not try to pick any big fights. We have a very long... trek to get back to base. There's a lot of stuff over here now, man. We got Dillos, we got the... That's a cool-looking... Berry, man. Level 100. Will most stuff leave us alone? I think so, right? So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go... out to the ocean. And swim back. It'll be a lot faster than... <laughs> than crawling around on this guy. 
That was nuts, man. I can't believe I deleted the wrong bag. Next time, we need to make sure that we keep all the death markers on the map until we collect everything. That way, if, if we would have lost this bag, it would have been horrible, man. Would have deleted the footage, started the whole day over, and you would never know that it happened. Not really, man. Would have left it in. But it would have been a very, very bad day. Especially since our first team was a shiny one, man. That's kind of the only thing that saved us. Let's get in the water down here. And kind of speed up our process for getting to the other side. <laughs> this side of the map to where the water is. This thing is super slow, dude. But when we get in the water, he should be super fast. Now, I did a lot of loot drop runs in between the last video and this one. We do have some scuba stuff. So that'll help out. Yeah, there we go, man. There we go. Very, very nice team. Horrible colors! <laughs> but, very nice team to have. Dangerous, man. Holy crap, are they dangerous. We are never walking across the map again. Holy crap, dude, that's a lot further than I thought. It's almost evening time already. Yep, there's the snake in the background. It was moving. It just stopped now. Super weird. But let's get up here. It should be a little bit easier to get back to base. Might try to grab this blue drop up here. Now, the cool thing about these guys, man, is that amount of damage they do with that, that big bite. And kind of helps out in the boss fights and stuff. Normal damage isn't too high, but that, that big bite, man, it is massive. Now, I don't think they do damage to other tames. We do have friendly fire turned on, I think. So I need to check that. That was so I could kill off the other creatures and stuff with our our weapons when we're doing our breeding. There's a red drop up there too. It's right over by base. Let's check this real quick. I thought these are a little bit faster in the water, but they're not. I need to remove that death marker too. I don't want to be reminded of what happened today. I can't believe we lost our cat, man. Ah, dude. High level and everything too. He was almost max level. And I put him on passive. I should have never had him on passive. We okay? Absolutely nothing. I'll take the food. I'll we'll take the crystal. Might as well. Take the stimulants. I'm not worried about the rest. It's fine, dude. We got so much junk in our inventory. We good? Alright. Let's get back to base. And probably red drop is gone now. Probably go ahead and still do our breeding. I still want to try to get the stats moved over. Shouldn't take very long with the better breeding, so... At least that'll be sorted out, you know? Wait. Free swimming? What is... What does that mean? Free swimming? Surface swimming. Interesting! So, you know, whenever you're, you're normally swimming around on a tame... If you look down, that's how you go... Sometimes you go down in the water and stuff? Does that have to do with that? That's the Gigabyte. Free swimming. I don't know. I'm not exactly sure what that means. He stays on the top, though. You don't have to worry about him, him falling down in. That's kind of cool. Kind of confused by it. I'll have to look it up, see what it's all about. Watch this drop will disappear as soon as we get up here. I did go ahead and throw out the, uh, the souls for our two teams. We don't have an uh, Oasis Sore, and I think it's kind of a broken mechanic, reviving them anyways. Alright, put you right here. Hang tight, buddy. We're almost home. We're almost home. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. Let's drop all this. I mean, the soups are fine. The one black pearl is kind of nice. It's kind of terrible for a red drop, though. So I'm hoping we have enough room out here. I'm thinking about not doing the wall and just leaving the plant species up. I need to replace our tree, too. I was told that the tree that we knocked down with the Maywing, that they are in the JVH pack. Yeah, these things are massive, dude. All right, leave you right there. Is your inventory empty? It's not. I'll take this and that and this. Hello? Wrong button. Leave all that. We got 18 points. Not worried about it. We're going to be doing some breeding and get those changed over anyways. So you are activated. Let's pull some food over. And let's go ahead and pull some berries as well. Just so that we have them. Change our food amount like I always do. 25. 
Alright, so, let's sort our life out real quick. <laughs> it's been... It's been busy, dude. Wait, um... It's twice now I've done that. I've named the folder folder. So we need this to keep, and that. We don't need this. We do need our arrows. And then... The sickle, which I do need to repair. Everything else we're kind of... Kind of not needing. We can throw into here. Kind of cool that we got a black pearl, though. Haven't seen those drop in those in a very long time. And then this. Oh, leave our, our gilly as well. I'm kind of curious, though, man. What stats we would have got from the other ones. If we would have been able to actually tame them. Drop that. Alright, we good? It's like it never happened. I mean, other than the, the cat missing. Kind of sucks, man. Really sucks. Gonna be honest with you. Look at me like that. You're part of the problem. You're also part of the solution. Let's back up. Yeah. <laughs> Not down there, buddy. I wanted to throw it far enough to where we don't get stuck in in the creature, you know? Okay, that works. Oh, what was the stats on this guy? Now that I threw him out. Anything good? Probably not. Better than what we had. Five, eight, three, and four. Yep. Totally not better. Maybe we'll get the colors from him and not from the princess. That's kind of the goal. Now we gotta work out something for hatching the eggs as well. We could just... ...allow the terminal to do it, you know? It's all turned on, so maybe we'll do that. Let's put a couple of these into here. Ah, I need to move all the eggs, too. All right, just getting our refrigerator somewhat sorted. So that's good. All of our kibble eggs kind of cleans us up a little bit as well. And then we're good here. And there's our one egg there that should be a male or female. And then while that's kind of working there, I want to go ahead and get the... Beer barrel going for our greenhouse. Got enough for two. So that'll work out. We'll get those kind of going. We'll set it out here for right now. Maybe... Maybe just right over here. Maybe right there by the generator. How much gas do we have? 122. 46 more. Dude, something with ASA I've noticed too. Sometimes whenever I die, it changes my mouse sensitivity. Normally mine is super, super low, but now it's like super, super high, dude. Very, very weird. It'll fix itself once I relog, but until then, it's kind of broken, man. Oh, we got two of these. We'll just use the vanilla ones. It should be fine. And then... Well, maybe right here will work, too. Oh, those are... Yeah, that's not going to work. Hold on. I want to change it around the other way. Snapping's kind of weird. With these. There we go, that'll work. So they should be irrigated. Let's pull some thatch. And then some berries we'll do... We've got those in there. Four hundred of the stem berries. And then what flavor do we want for over here? Maybe the blue ones? I'll farm up some more with the, the beaver. But at least that'll be kind of sorted out for the next video. We'll probably go ahead, like I said, put that up there. Might put the generator up there too. Just to kind of get it away from here. We'll see, man. We'll see. How is the egg? It's ready. We still got a hatchet, which is a thing. Too cold. We need some fires, and then we need to turn that off so it doesn't pick it up. I wonder if right here will be enough. Oh, it hatched! Oh, fantastic! That should pick it up. It did. It's got the <laughs> it's got the ugly colors. It's a male though, so that kind of works too. Those colors are nuts, man. So we got all the good stats, right? 55, 51, 75, 47. So what we'll do is take this one. 
I want to keep you for colors. I do. I really do. We'll hold on to you. I'll do the color breeding off camera. But that'll be instantly our... Oh, got to raise it up too, man. What am I doing? Put you right there. That'll be our colors for the... Uh, or not colors. Uh, stuck on the colors, man. That'll be our breeding pair. And then for this one... The rights? You're kind of in the ground, Junior. Let's pull you forward some. They're so tiny and grow up to be so big. Lowest. Right, there you go. There you go. There you go. Four-wheel drive, buddy. Four-wheel drive, man. Ugly little thing. Super ugly. I know. Don't eat me because I'm talking about your little one. But you are. You do have food, so you're good. Options, change name. Let's give it a few minutes. Junior will be raised up, and then we're kind of set for the day, man. For the most part, for the most part. Main thing I wanted was a beer barrel out. Whenever we got back to base here. Stop looking at me. Can't even see through the frost on your eyes. Kind of cool though, man. Little pygmy one. There we go. Junior is raised up. Probably about out of food, man. These things eat a ton of food. So all we're missing now mainly is just the the colors, right? Wouldn't mind finding a better one for damage. Put this here. And the cool thing about the shiny mod too, if you didn't know, is say we uninstall the mod right now, we'd have a normal gator over there, and this one would still be here too. So it doesn't really affect the the ones if you uninstall it, you know. Back you up some. Put you on mating. And that one should still be on it, right? Stop, man, stop! The snouts, dude, they're, they're, they're very, very long and pushy around. It is, so get some more eggs. Ah, dude, well, I mean, not too bad of a day. It kind of went both better and worse than I thought. I was mainly worried that we wouldn't be able to find any of the new dinosuchers on the map. However, there are a massive amount in the swamp. Now, the swamp here, it's, it's kind of a long swamp, but it's very narrow, right? So not very much room to move around. I kind of got a little bit too comfortable, seeing how the first team went very, very fast, as well as the second one, and we kind of got into a bad spot. Lost not one, but two of our cats. However, we got our good team. It was a shiny one, changed right before our eyes, man. It was kind of weird, not gonna lie. But, got it tamed up. We've got a 180 max level. We've got another one. The colors are horrible on it, man. Holy crap, dude. I definitely got to work off camera on doing the breeding, get those changed out, but we are using those for the boss fight. So we just got to find some saddles, and we're kind of set as far as teams go for the boss fight. A lot of artifact runs to do. However, we are going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.